Welcome to the Lotus Hotel of India, the most elegant hotel in all of India. One of the biggest influences in religious Indian culture is art. Many sculptures use bronze, gold, silver, diamonds, and other riches. These materials give sculptures importance. Indian cliff paintings have been found that are over 5,000 years old. Now we're on to literature. Indian books were written in languages like Sanskrit, Prakrit, uh, Pali, and Bengali. The earliest known literature was Hindu sacred writings, like the Veda, which was written in Sanskrit around 1900 BCE. Poetry, plays, and songs followed soon after, being written around the 1st to the 17th centuries. Our next topic is Indian films, otherwise known as Bollywood. The first movies were made by travelers in 1896. The Lumiere brothers were played in six short films in Bombay. The first full-length film was made by Dada Shaheb Falke in 1913. However, television later expanded to include school information. First talking film was made in 1931 by Arishir Irani. Indian television first aired on September 15, 1959 in Delhi. It aired twice a week to discuss topics such as health, citizen rights, and traffic. However, television later expanded to include school information. Television became so important to people that the Indian government had to create the Department of National Television and Broadcasting. Before television, Indian music included ancient instruments that date back to the prehistoric era. The first instruments were drums and flute and dates back to the prehistoric era. Music was primarily used in religion when priests would chant during rituals to evoke the gods. Another place where music has been used was in theater. The central unit of theater was dance. Early theater used dances, masks, costumes, gestures, verbal sounds to communicate and entertain. Very first performance known was done by cave dwellers and evolved over time into an art form. Theatrical culture was influenced by the British Empire. Originally, theater portrayed acts of heroism. Over time, theater began to portray modern issues like daily life and loss. Dance tradition in India was first defined in the 19th century. Dances were originally held in temples like this one for the gods. Classical Indian dance was originally a solo performing art. Many different modern dances have roots in Indian culture. Loincloths cloths were often used for daily wear, festive occasions, special dances, and rituals. Hindu females wore white clothing to often indicate mourning. Parsis and Christians wore white to weddings. The color of their clothing can differ depending on the location. What about those useless flags? You don't. But you will when we, when we go to the Lotus Hotel in India. What's that? The most elegant hotel in all of India. <gasps> we should go there. Let's go!